Case, you with me? Just like that, huh? Just like that. Ever do anything like this before? No. But I don't see any better options, and I'm running out of bullets. Get ready! It is all hands on deck here. What the hell happened? We busted Adler out. You broke into a CIA black site to free Russell Adler. Are you out of your mind? Something's going on, Jane. Something big. Okay, Adler was right. The agency is compromised. You sure it's not Adler? No, but the guys that hit the black site? They weren't friends of his. What guys? It was the Pantheon. The same group that showed up out of nowhere in Kuwait. There's no way that they can know about the black side unless someone inside the CIA is feeding them intel, someone higher. Is it Livingston? Maybe. Listen, Troy. They are pinning the attack on you, all of you. Woods, Case, Adler. You're on Interpol's most wanted list. Red notices all around. Yeah, I got the picture. I can help. No, it's better if you're insulated from any blowback. Shining armor shit, Troy. You want to help? Keep digging. Look into Livingston. Okay, let me see what I can do. Thanks. And Jane. Yeah. Don't trust anyone. A liability? Seriously? You'd never pass for Delta. An interpreter, then. You don't even speak Arabic. I'm wasting my breath. I'm not taking a vote here. Okay, you're staying back. I want you here with Felix and Woods. Well, if you have this figured out, I'm not just going to sit around. I'm going out. Let her go. Moving on. Adley, you sure that's all the lie we told you? Before you executed him? You're in my world now, Marshal. Gonna have to grow up fast. I'm listening. Alawi knew the Pantheon had a presence in Iraq. It's part of a technology exchange with Saddam Hussein. Pantheon gets cover in facilities. Hussein gets access to an experimental weapon. But Alawi didn't know what the weapon was? No. Only that they're calling it the Cradle. The Cradle? The Cradle. And it's in Iraq right now? Presumably. Alawi said it was in transit to a remote palace. Demonstrations taking place in a bunker underneath. Hussein is a world-class collector of palaces. There are many on this map alone. Alawi was confident he knew the one. Yes. This one. Let's take a first-hand look, then. We'll finalize plans soon, and we'll ship out. Dismiss. I'll take these. Enjoy them. I brought them for you. Figured. You don't usually smoke the shit brands. Don't want you raising your standards. Well, there's never been a better time to be cheap as hell. Hey. Yeah. Listen, I understand that in your own Adler-ass way you invited us to this place. Maybe you've got squatters rights, but don't much care. You got a point? What I do care about 
What I need you to understand is that this here is my team. You need us more than we need you, okay? We broke you out of that black site, and I just need an excuse to send you back. Bottom line, you're a stranger to me. All I got on you is your reputation, and it ain't all roses, either. Well, you don't have to trust me, Marshal. But it might be best if you do, for you and your team. I'll be the judge of that. Ooh, a contest. So exciting. Should I get a ruler? By the way, Adler, I'm still waiting to get paid. I had a little something stashed for you upstairs, but it seems I was robbed while on vacation. Nah, he just loaned it to us. Forgot to tell you is all. Surprise. I just think you and I should spend some quality time together. We should get plenty in Iraq. My thoughts exactly. So, here we are. I'd been in contact with Alawi since the beginning of the year. He wanted a red carpet out of Iraq and was willing to talk for it. As a minister of defense, his value was high, and he knew it. After coalition forces attacked, well, his timeline changed. I was to meet him in Kuwait and supply passage through Europe. Seems I wasn't the only one who knew his plans. After Frank got out of Walter Reed, the news was that I put him in that chair. I was the one who compromised his Panama mission in 89, got Hudson and Mason killed, Woods injured. All bullshit. When I skipped town, I went silent on him, on everyone. Better he hate me than get caught in the net, but I guess it didn't matter in the end. So yeah, he did take a leap. He's loyal. Last March, someone produced documents showing encrypted transfers. From the drug lord Raul Menendez to my personal bank account. I got wind of it before Langley called me in from Morocco. Decided not to get on that plane. I'm sure he is. And so are a lot of operatives up on the memorial wall. A big heart will weigh you down. I don't know if you had the pleasure of working with Jason Hudson. He was one of the casualties back in Panama. Just weeks before he died, he told me about a paramilitary group that may have infiltrated the CIA. Guess what they were called? Hudson seemed to believe they were homegrown, maybe transnational, but American-dominated. Most likely military and intelligence expats. The recruits seem Western-trained, English-speaking. They know how to think like us, which makes them especially dangerous. Uh-huh.
I've known Adler since Nam. Give it 20 years. He'll grow on you. Maybe you should be getting ready. Poor Savati. The nightlife around here is limited to owls and jackals. Sub case. Figure in this line of work, you'll end up in all sorts of crosshairs. But the CIA's dedicated my life to our country, you know? I believed in its potential. Still do, despite everything. After Capitol Station? Hell, I don't see the cavalry coming either. We're all there is. He spent the last year gunning for the old guard at Langley. Maybe he was the mole behind Panama, too. If it wasn't Adler, someone shorted a bang-up job making it look that way. I don't know, man. Can't say it all adds up. Adler expects everyone to Michael Jordan when he says jump, but I don't do no questions asked. Cat knows a lot more than he lets on. You've heard the rumors. Adler's a wildfire. Burns through whatever's in his way if he gets the job done. Thing is, I'm not dancing to that tune. We're putting an end to the Pantheon and getting out of this thing alive. <laughs> Tell me about it. Woods is really maxing out his credit on this one. But he's got a hell of a large line of it. Later. in Iraq, Syrian desert. There's a complication. Desert storm. Coalition forces launched the operation two weeks ago against Saddam Hussein. They've taken out as many strategic targets from the air as possible. They haven't destroyed the palace yet, but that's about to change. British SAS forces are on the ground hunting mobile Scud launchers, and they've marked our palace for massive aerial bombing. That can't happen. We don't know what Pantheon's hiding in the bunker under the palace. If it's destroyed, we lose the trail. I reached out to an old collaborator of mine at MI6 for a favor. She pressured the SAS to delay their airstrike, but it'll come at a cost. We're gonna pose as Delta Force operatives so this Helen Park can get us to the front. Then we're gonna help the SAS clean up those scud launchers. After that, the palace is ours.
Rubbish and unload the trucks. Yes, sir. We're building our layup here. Your crew's not too shabby, Park. <laughs> now let's see what else they've got. This will be our base of operations for now. Here, you won the straw vote and get to carry the tack map. We've got a lot of ground to cover, so you'll find it useful. We need to neutralize three more Scud sites. Stay alert out there. You might find other things of interest as well. Gladney's promised to help your team breach the palace if you destroy those Scuds. Help him out, and we'll see if he's a man of his word. You can talk to him yourself if you'd like. He'll stay here in the layup, working logistics for the SAS. Once you're ready to head out, we'll follow your lead. Need something? I've sent Jackal 1 for the Scuds in sectors 7, 8 and 9. The rest are yours. We put advanced scouts on the ground to find the sites and they're still out there. If you meet any, they might have additional intel. Let's hope they make short work of their targets. Don't worry. If all goes according to plan, they'll be back in time to help raid the palace. That is, if you uphold your end of the deal. What do you have in mind? They're still in the field. If you're looking for them, they're likely near the Scud launching sites. Not at the moment. It's too many bloody surface-to-air missiles. In fact, I just received word that some of your Delta Force friends were shot down nearby. We have our own attack helo, but it's not getting up there unless you find some way to disable the SAM sites in this region. The Iraqis have a few new encampments, likely connected to these cross-border missile strikes. Intel reports several unusual forces embedded in the camps. I'm not sure what you should expect there. You're mostly on your own there. Command's made some supply drops in the area, but we haven't had a chance to retrieve them. If you find any, they're yours. So much interest in this palace. If it was up to me, we'd have blown it to Kingdom Come by now. The only reason it's still standing is Miss Park over there. Interesting indeed. Yeah. Just help us take out the remaining scuds and we'll help you get whatever it is you need. Best of British to you out there. Got no shortage of guns. Have whatever gear you want. Might want some of that C4. Should have tear right through a scud launcher. We'll get going when you're all told up. Case, if there's anything else you want to know about the mission, I'd speak to Gladney over there. We ready? We've got gunfire to the right. Over those dunes. Careful. This is Lieutenant Colonel Bannon of Delta Force. Requesting immediate backup. Down Hilo, America. Thank you, Yusuf. Where the hell? Doesn't matter. I need. 
need to call an airstrike. Terminal's inside the helo. Go! <gasps> mission was over till you showed up. Thank you. From one Delta unit to another. Keep the SATCOM. Godspeed. An airstrike. Pretty nice parting gift. <sighs> I might be Delta Force forever after this. Over that ridge, see it? Radar dishes south of here.
Over there. That orange smoke marks a supply drop. Might be worth checking out. Our style's trying to steal our shit. I'll keep an eye out. That'll help. We should grab any others we find. Let's keep moving. Might put that to good use against the Scud. Eyes up for those SAM sites. If we take them out, we'll have an aerial advantage. Mark, you work with Gladney? A handful of ops, but this is the first time we're sharing the field. He makes an impression. True. I've never seen men so loyal. Someone forgot their boat. I was wondering where I left that. Probably been here for years. More orange smoke means more supplies. Check it out. Palm trees. The date farm. It has one of our scud launchers. Got eyes on tangos. Haven't spotted us yet.
Gladney, we've spotted one of the SAM sites. That's risky.
Our two subjects, brothers, began exposure. Patient A through injection. Like a pro. Glad they've got a scout nearby. Target locked. Thank you, Doug. Woo, you're natural at this case. One more left. They'll be looking for us. Move out. It appears your mystery group might be real after all, Adler. But you don't trust me? Just as much as I need to. Don't act surprised. Looks like they've been calling in some friends. The plans are falling apart. Someone was bound to complain. Road forks ahead. Another SAM site over there. We can hit it now or later. Your call, Case. Roger that. Incoming. Better leave before they find our asses. They're on us! Water strike made short work of that situation. Not too shabby. One more SAM site to go. You all might get on Gladney's good side. Sam sites, scuds. Lucky he didn't add his laundry to that list. 
We were helping the Iraqis a few years ago. Now we're firing at them. We gave Hussein a surplus of weapons and transport. Mm. Must have gotten to his head. He messed up. Better get that into his head. That's the last SAM site up ahead. Let's wrap this up tighter, shall we? Here we go! Tower on that hill. Wonder what it's transmitting. Damn, look at the size of those. Case, let's head to the layer. Security ahead. A lot of security. Gotta be guarding something important. Our last scud launcher is hiding amongst all that construction. Jackal 2, maybe at the layer. On our way to the layer, Gladney. Clear. Good to see it, mates. There you are. In the I've got something for you. Nice work on those SAM sites. We've pulled the tiger's tail now. Got the helo ready to go. Call it in when ready. We got incoming. The Rocky forces are converging on our position. Time to put your head on the test. Chainsaw 32 on station.
out in the area. Copy that. Diesel one inbound. Change on three two, clear to engage. Scout from the top of the ridge inside that tent. Glad you made it, Delta. Let me show you what I'm seeing. They'll see him go down. I wouldn't take that shot. Look to your right. Might alert someone. Chainsaw 32 on station. Just getting warmed up, right? Need something? Impressive. Now that's out of the way. If you're ready to move on that palace, I'll notify my men. We go in now, we go in with what we have. You sure? I'll give the word.
too. We're getting into this palace fast and getting out faster. Once you do the necessary, we're wiping it off the map. Roger that, Jack One. We're not sticking around for tea. <laughs> Probably dreadful anyway. We're looking for a bunker. Our best guess is that we can access it on the far side of the grounds. We'll see you through. After that, it's up to Talon One to lift us all out in one piece. That's my preference. So let's get to it then. We're nearly there. Better be it. Really make you work for it, don't they? Dom's hoarding millions down here. Hell, 
This gold toilet's worth that much. You can trade it all for a WMD. We're close. Case there. Check it out. What do we got? The cradle. Panthean has a goddamn biological weapon. And they put this in Saddam's hands, too? A sample of it. Based on what I'm seeing in here. What'd you find? A disc. Some notes, all in Russian. The project's headed by Matvi Gusev. Sounds like you know him. I recognize the name. Gusev was a scientist in the Soviet Union's biological weapons program, Biopreparat. Intelligence had him fleeing Russia last year. Then he vanished. Gusev gave the Pantheon a Soviet bioweapon? No. According to this, the cradle came from somewhere else. A research facility I'm familiar with. It's American. America. All right, visiting time's over, you three. We need your help up here. In the top side. Let's move. You get what you wanted? Not exactly, but we got what we needed. <laughs> 